Hello, this is Francis from McCaffrey's Crafts and today I'm just going to answer another type of question related to the video I did yesterday. Um, and this day, today it's about like holly as a, as a use for making a shillelagh. Um, holly um, is a quite, quite a handy wood and I have used it before in the past and there are several references to holly being used in cudgels and shillelaghs uh, as well. Um, throughout uh, throughout Irish history, um, so yeah, so like the the holly people always saw it for for good luck, you know. If you, you didn't want to cut it down, you know, back in ancient times things were were very superstitious. Um, everyone knows about holly for um, for for Christmas trees and 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 things like that, and the holly reeds they put on on graves as well. Like it's uh, you know usually at Christmas time they do up like these these special like reeds that a lot of people would make these handmade type of reeds which was another kind of craft in itself and then they put these on their on christmas times on the graves in in ireland and um, some people put like you know reed on the door you know reed is like a circular kind of bouquet type of thing that they'd make um you know with the the, the red cherry the red fruit and the, the the leafy things but um getting back to holly um for shillelaghs and for for walking sticks um can holly be used as a shillelagh yeah um, can it be used for walking sticks? Of course. Um, the only thing about holly is it's like a really white wood. Like it's it's like you know you'd say it's even the white one of the whitest woods out there. So if you are using holly, like usually you have to kind of stain the wood. Uh, but it actually is quite nice. Like once you stain it and polish it, like it has a nice grain. Um, it is actually a quite a heavy wood as well, and and a fine grain on it as well. So it has a bit of weight and a bit of heft into it. And a lot of the pieces of wood you find in the hedges are actually quite, quite thick. It's, it's hard enough to find one that's like about an inch diameter. Like most of the holly bushes, you know, they've been there for some time and a lot of them are pretty, pretty thick, heavy pieces. So like what I've used holly for before is for making cudgels and uh, different things like that. It's like there's some wallop in it. It's like a really heavy wood. So um, holly is a beautiful wood. You can use it like for, for making things, for furniture, for walking sticks. But just remember that point about um, you'd have to use like a stain or something because like it just, you know, when you just you have bare holly and you put a, a, like a glossy finish or something on it, it just doesn't look right. It just looks a bit kind of, you know, too, too pale, too weisty. Just like an Irish person, I suppose, like, or, you know, the, the stereotype of the Irish person at the beach being the whitest person there, uh, you know, because we don't see any sunshine because it's always cloudy, which is true. But uh, yeah, so there's kind of like a quick kind of uh, synopsis of, of holly. Uh, there's, there's good kind of uh, tradition of it. Um, and uh, yeah, sure, I'll, I'll leave it at that anyway. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.